what's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my youtube channel today i'm gonna basically tell you how to fix the corrupted error data error in uh the last of us 2 so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial in the end you will perfectly know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue before we start right into the video i just want you guys to know let you guys know that, that i would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or a subscription right into my youtube channel it would really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber as i am especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys you would support my work in youtube a little bit and i'm gonna really really be thankful for that and i'm gonna thank you for that so anyways i would just say let's get right started so the first step in order to fix this kind of issue is going to be to open up your task manager but just simply navigating down to your taskbar you're going to right click and open up your task manager what i want you to do next is going to be to navigate to the top left corner of the screen and navigate right onto details. What I want you to do at details is gonna be to uh, scroll down till you find steam.x and I want you to simply left click and click onto set priority. When you click on set priority, I want you to click on everything above normal, so high or above normal. So click on that and uh, you could do that and also search for your the last of us and you could do this also for this but you have to have this game running while doing that so that's the first step once you did that you should be able to end this task and the next step is going to be to take your steam or your the last of us to shortcut on your desktop you're going to right click and navigate to the very bottom where it says properties you're going to hit compatibility and uh simply copy my settings so let's quickly run through it compatibility mode enable run this program compatibility mode for select windows 8 Go to disable the disable full screen optimizations as well as enable run this, this program as an administrator. Hit apply and OK. Yeah, guys, this should fix your issue. That's it for the video. I hope that I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm going to really be thankful for that. And I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just going to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.